Lesson 21 homework. Divide, then check using multiplication. The first one's done for you. 158 divided by 37. 37, it can't go into 1, so I'm going to put a 0 above the 1. It can't go into 15, so I'll put a 0 above the 15. So we need to see how many times 37 can go into 158. I'm going to estimate. So I think 37 could go into 158 maybe about 6 times. So I'm going to try 37 times 6. 6 times 7 is 42. 6 times 3 is 18 plus 4. It's 22, so that's too big. I'm going to try 37 times 4 now. 4 times 7 is 28, carry the 2. 4 times 3 is 12, plus 2 is 148, so that works. If I added another one, it would be too big because we're trying to fit into 158. So it can go in 4 times. 4 times 37 is 148. Subtract, we get 10 as a remainder. There's nothing to bring down, so we have 4, remainder, 10. And then our check would be 37 times 4 is equal to 148. And 148 plus 10 is equal to 158. C, 261 divided by 49. So 49 can't go into 2, and it can't go into 26. 49 is really close to 50. And I know 50 could go into 261. So we have 50, 100, 150, 200, 250, five times. So I'm going to try 49 times 5. 9 times 5 is 45. 4 times 5 is 20, plus 4 is 24. So if I added another 49, it would be too big. So it can go in five times. So we get 16, there's nothing to bring down, so we have 5, remainder, 16. And our check, we could do 49 times 5 equals 245, and 245 plus 16, which is the remainder, is equal to 261. 574 divided by 82. So 82, I'm going to, it's closest, I'm going to round that to 100. So 100 could go into 574 five times, but 82 is a bit smaller, so I'm going to try 82 times 6. 6 times 2 is 12, carry the 1. 8, 6 times 8 is 48, plus 1 is 49. So we get 492. I'm going to see if I can add another group of 82. Oh, we get exactly 574. So it could go in six times, plus I added another one. So that would give us seven times. There's no remainder, so our answer is just seven. Our check would be. 82 times 7 equals 574. 464 divided by 58. So it can't go into 4 and it can't go into 46. 58, let's see, 50 could go into 450. We have 50, 100, 150, 200, 250, 300, 350, 400, 450, so 9 times. I'm going to try 58 times 9. It might be a little big. So we get 72. 9 times 5 is 45, plus 7 is 52. So 522, that's a little too big. So I'm going to subtract a group of 58. we get 464. So we had nine groups, but then I subtracted one. So we have eight groups is 464. No remainder, so then our check would just be 
58 times 8 equals 464. 640 divided by 79. So 79 is really close to 80. And I know 8 times 8 is 64. So 80 times 8 would be 640. So I'm going to try 79 times 8. 9 times 8 is 72. 8 times 7 is 56. Plus 7 would be 63. So we get 632, which is very close to 640. So we can go in 8 times. We subtract. We would have 8 remainder 8. And our check would say 8 times 79 equals 632, and 632 plus 8 equals 640. Takes Juan exactly 35 minutes by car to get to his grandmother's. The nearest parking area is a four minute walk from her apartment. One week, he realized that he spent five hours and 12 minutes traveling to her apartment and then back home. How many round trips did he make to visit his grandmother? So it's asking how many round trips. So round trips means there and home. So if it takes him 35 minutes there, and then he walks four minutes, then he's, he's at her apartment in 39 minutes. But then he has to go all the way back home. So that's another 39 minutes. 39 minutes plus 39 minutes is 78 minutes. So one trip is 78 minutes. So five hours and 12 minutes. Since this is in minutes, let's get this also in minutes. So five hours times 60 is 300 minutes plus 12 minutes is 312 minutes. So we need to see how many groups of 78 minutes can go into 312 minutes. Let's try, I think it could go in about three times. So eight times three is 24. Three times seven is 21 plus two is 23. So that's a little low. I'm gonna add another group of 78. Four, time, four plus eight is 12. So there we get 312. So it can go in four times. So he made four round trips. How many 84s are in 672? So it can't go in six or 67. So let's try 84 times seven. Again, I'm just estimating. I looked and saw, and I think 84 could go into 672 about seven times. I know it would be, two would be too small, and 10 is too big, so. Seven times four is 28. Eight times seven is 56, plus two is 58. So let's see if we could add another time. Eight plus four is 12, 16, 17. 672. So it could go in 7 plus 1. It can go in 8 times. 8 times 84 is 672. So 8 times.